Question I want to know, Sheikh, is it true that sinning during Ramadan is worse than sinning outside of Ramadan? In terms of uh, multiplying, we can't say yes. Uh, Qatada, he said, is worse. Qatada, yes. He said it's worse. But in, ter in terms of enlargement, yes, it is. If a person can sin in the month of Ramadan next to the Kaaba, then he would bound to sin in Luton next to the nightclub. <laughs> so if he's next to the Kaaba and in the month of Ramadan, he would be bound to sin in that place in a different Ramadan. Because we say that if you can't really restrain yourself from sins in Ramadan, it's very impossible to see yourself. That is to be restrained from sins in outside Ramadan. And this is not the saying of me. This is what we have extracted from the hadith of the Prophet ﷺ. When he said, Bu'adallah. He made a dua. Said, uh, uh, when the Jibri al -Salam, he said to him, Oh Muhammad, Allah said, that is, what a loser he is. May his nose be smeared in the dust. Disgrace to him. Far away he is from the blessings and the mercy of Allah. The one who lives to see Ramadan, yet he does not secure himself a pardoning. So this person came to Ramadan, he lost Ramadan. He did not do the ibadah properly. He, didn't, he lost it. So this one has been distanced away from the mercy of Allah. May his nose be smeared in the dust, means what a loser he is. So how about this person has not just lost Ramadan. No, he did even sins in Ramadan. He is sinning inside Ramadan. The worst. Okay. So we say that to that person, they don't really multiply, but in the sight of Allah, they must have been greater. Okay, must be greater. Naam.